What's up guys, it is Nice Drake. I am back with a simple quick video today to give you a little bit of Season 3 knowledge uh, on Splitgate Arena Warfare. Now obviously, there's not a lot I can say. Uh, however, I'm going to tell you as much as I possibly can uh, with maybe a bit of information you haven't heard before because I'm personally involved. Uh, however, if you're in the Discord for Splitgate, you'll have seen my involvement and stuff uh, and what I've got in the game. So, uh, let's just dive right in. Okay, so as far as official things that Splitgate have said, uh, they posted a couple of screenshots of uh, the new maps to Twitter. Uh, I'm not sure if they posted every single one, I think maybe just a few. I can't tell you exactly how many they are. Uh, but they posted some new maps and said there will be a new game mode, which I've played and tested for, I'd say, maybe four or five hours in total. Uh, and I can tell you straight away, it is the most fun I've had on the game in um, my you know, few months of playing. Season 3 will be amazing. Uh, and I'm going to be grinding that game mode every single day <laughs> and uh, trying to get to the top of the leaderboards and stuff on that. So, it'll be really fun. It's quite unique. Uh, it takes the style of game mode from other games. Again, I can't really say which because it kind of gives it away. Um, but it's a style of game mode you've seen in previous titles, but it's got its own twist to it with um, some systems, some mechanics that they have put in. Uh, so it'll be very fun. It's nothing like you've ever seen before on Splitgate, so something new, something to try out, so you should definitely hop on uh, to Season 3 and try that when it drops. Um, however, I can give you a little bit of inside information on cosmetics for the game, because I actually have, as far as I'm aware, uh, three or four skins, maybe some sprays uh, in the game as well, as well as my own, because I'm a Splitgate partner now, so I get my own cool Made Straight logo spray. Uh, and maybe a creator code, I think we still have to set that up. Um, so soon I'll be plugging use code Nade straight <laughs> in the Splint Gate store. Um, but I'm going to put pictures or videos on screen of cosmetics that I've made, and I'm allowed to do this because people have already seen it. If they're in the Discord, I got permission to post the things that I make in there. Um, so I can give you a bit of, you know, insider new information if you, uh, if you don't keep up to date with the Discord. Uh, you won't have seen this before. So I have three skins um, that I'm, I'm pretty sure are in. The fourth one might be, or it might be too late, because I only did it maybe like two or three weeks before Season 3. Um, so I'm not 100% sure on that one. However, the skins that I think are in, uh, Paint Splatter was the first pistol skin that I designed. Um, I made a mock-up of it, and that's what got me involved in the team in the first place. Uh, I mocked it up in Photoshop in the space of maybe 20-30 minutes um, using assets from around the web and textures that I had saved from previous jobs and stuff like that. And uh, whacked it all together, posted it in the Discord, and I got a message um, from Cardinal, who is the uh, owner of uh, 1047 Games, uh, who makes Splitgate. And he said, on a serious note, do you want to make skins for the game? So I just said yes, obviously. We sorted out a contract and stuff eventually. And uh, I officially make skins for the game in my own time. It's not a job. Uh, I just sort of do it freelance as and when I want, when I've got time. Because I obviously have my own job and I'm running my own business and stuff at the same time as well. Um, so whenever I get spare time, I make cosmetics. So, yeah, so far... Uh, all the skins I've done are pistols and moving on to assault rifles and carbines. Uh, so hopefully in the next season or maybe in uh, you know item store in the future you'll see some uh, some more stuff on me. I also have the virus skin, which was um, obviously the recent issues with the world pandemic um, <laughs> made me think maybe as a joke I should put in uh, a virus skin. Everyone loved it. It, it. I think it'll do really well because obviously it suits the current um, situation everyone's in. Everyone can relate to it and it's kind of just a fun prod at, you know, the fact that everyone is at home playing games right now. So let's just put something related to that in a video game. Uh, and then the next one is Racer, which didn't come out as I intended it to, but it still looks nice. I want it to look like an F1 car skin or vinyl. Um, you'll all know what that looks like, you know. And then the other skin, which I'm not sure is in, however, I believe I can show it. <laughs> I've actually shown this one to anyone, so maybe not. Um, maybe I can give you a peek, like a blurred picture or something. <laughs> but it's called Sea Life, and that's kind of the most I can say. It, it's got a Sea Life theme to it. Um, I might have shown it on stream once. I'm not 100% sure, but just to be safe, maybe I'll put a, a little bit of a sneak, not the full thing, in, um, in this video. So those are my things in the game. 
Uh, I do have some sprays, but I'm not 100% sure if they're in the season pass. I have my own logo, which I use on um, Twitch and sometimes on YouTube and then on my Twitter stuff. Um, and Instagram even. Um, people have seen that before. It's a you know, grenade character with an angry face and he's blue and grey and white. Um, that will be in uh, the game as well. So, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> So in regards to other cosmetics which I didn't make, obviously I can't say much about, however, I can tell you that as far as I'm aware, um, from what I've looked through, through the items I've scrolled through in my locker in the uh, QA tests and stuff, there is more skins coming, probably more than has ever been added in one batch um, at a time. Some old skins, new styles, some new sets altogether. Um, can't give names, can't give, you know, <laughs> ideas what they look like. Um, but. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of things coming, um, which, like, in comparison to uh, previous seasons and stuff. That's it. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, obviously, it helps. I'm sure everyone knows this by now. Liking and commenting and all that kind of stuff boosts your video in rankings in the algorithm, and of course, that also helps Splitgate get more traction. Um, so don't just help me, help the entire Splitgate community by spreading videos, messages, tournaments, everything you can, because it'll get more people playing the game, which is what we want. So yeah, uh, hope you enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do, and I'll see you in the next video. Alright, goodbye.